Yeah, one of the, the few ways that I can support different organisations is, is actually through making artwork for auction. Um, you know, artists aren't traditionally wealthy people, so you know, it's, it's difficult for me to actually contribute financially um, straight out. But um, you know, making work and then having it auctioned is, is the next best thing for me in terms of you know, financial support for organisations. As an artist, I actually have been involved in quite a few charitable um, auctions. Um, it's, for me, it's kind of part of the generosity and ethos of being an artist is to be able to uh, contribute this way to society. So, you know, it's great. I think one of the things that, and where art for science emanated from is one of the things we felt we could add value with was fundraising for the Institute independently and raising funds for ideas and for thinking and um, Terry and his team in terms of allocation of funds to give them money to think and to inspire them and to collaborate independently of any funding. powerful gesture and it's a very important part of our fundraising. We, we need people to give us money in a way where we can target it at the most promising discoveries and our scientists, our leading scientists can work out where the big discoveries are but we need some money to be able to put into it. I think two ways because it's, it's fundraising and it's for a worthy cause which is the cause side but the exposure that the artists get to a community that they won't always find easily unless they're through a gallery or unless they're sponsored or unless they just become famous and by the time they get famous they're already on another trajectory so this way is a way of, of launching them into another arena and into people that, that either do love art, want to love art and are thinking about how they can get further involved with their collection. Um, a couple of years ago Susie approached us and I I was just really intrigued with that art for science. I'd never come across that kind of connection. And given the clients that we look after, many of them collect art, many of them are involved in the science world, and it just seemed a perfect blend. So I was really intrigued, and when I talked to Susie, we thought this was a perfect fit for us. Yes, look, we've been very passionate about this for a long time. I mean, we've had, personally, uh, we've got four children uh, and one of our children has had a great uh, or an association with the children's hospital for about 10, 11 years and you know we're very passionate about ensuring that the, the sort of help that we got over that year continues for people in the future and you know that's all about raising money and helping people raise money um, you know to fund the programs and the sort of things that Murdoch actually undertake. <laughs> Thank you.